Why are you grilling my mom? She's not on trial. Because I want you to admit that Ricky Stanicki does not exist. Hey, my spooka! Let's get down to business! Oh, yes! Boys are back! Yes! All right! Jackie! Ricky? Oh, you look unbelievable! Oh. You're still a MILF. Oh, my God! Look at you! Oh, you haven't changed a bit! The mystery man in the flesh. Well, churn my butter with a slippery stick. I finally get to meet Aaron Harford. You're even more beautiful in person than the pictures Dean's always sending me. You send him pictures of me? Oh, tasteful, of course. Even the nudes. Seriously, the guy doesn't shut up about you. What were you saying about her last week? It was, um... Ah, the more I look at her, the more I realize how much there is to see. Oh, hey. And who do we have here? Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. I'm Carly, I'm Aaron's cousin. No need to shout, bullhorn! <laughs> <laughs> and I am the woman who had to give birth all alone because you tricked her husband into going to Albany. Oh my God, Susan, I'm so sorry. Uh, you know how much grief your old man's been giving me? For the record, I had no idea it was your baby shower. I just wanted to celebrate my new lease on life with my oldest, dearest friends. And then Whitaker comes along. God, I love that name. And then I just ruin everything. I just. Again, my sincerest apologies. No, you know, it's okay. I, I know you've been through a lot, so. Hell yeah, they lopped off one of my nuts for starters. <laughs> <laughs> you are still a handful. <laughs> well, half a handful. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, okay, Rico, hey, let's go show you around, huh? Oh, uh, aren't you gonna introduce me? Uh, we'll be right back. Stay away from that woman at all costs, okay? That's Susan's mother, she's bad news. Jesus. Hey, if anyone asks about the shaking, just say, I have low blood sugar and I had a Red Bull. Stopping you there. I don't appreciate mind readings. What? So, I lift up the mosquito net, and sure enough, Bono's in there. Plowing Mrs. Bono like a potato field. Really? The Bono? Yeah. Giving the Mrs. the old Irish shillelagh, as it were. <laughs> so I'm standing there embarrassed. And then they go, it's okay. Watch us. We like it. Is that an Irish thing? Oh, I don't think so. I wouldn't put it past them. Hey, the guy saved 10 million people from starving. So, if he wants to let people watch him corn beef his wife's cabbage, who am I to stop him? <laughs> you know who has the best corned beef in town? Jeff's. And it isn't even really a deli. I don't think that's the kind of corned beef he's talking about, Jeff. Oh, man, all this food talk is making me hungry. Ricky, have you eaten yet? Dean! You haven't introduced me to Indiana Jones here. <laughs> yeah, of course. Ted, this is... Ricky Stanicki, my good friend. Uh, Ricky, this is Ted Summerhays, my boss. Ted, nice to meet you. Digging the suit in the seedlings, man. The seedlings? The hair plugs, they're new, right? What? No. This is my hair. Ha! <laughs> yeah, that's... Like a doll's hair is her hair. That's good. That's good. So, Ted, you're one of those big banker guys, eh? One of those guys out there helping those billionaires get richer and then floating around on your... Big swinging super yachts, leaving everybody else struggling to make ends meet in their little dinghies. No, 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 not at all. First of all, we sell financial services to independent investors, and anyone who's willing to pay for them is welcome to share in the benefits. Whatever helps you sleep at night, Ebenezer. <laughs> ah, memory serves me. Ebenezer Scrooge ends up becoming the hero of that story. It's Ricky, right? Yeah. I'm wondering, Ricky, are you always such a bust out right out of the gate? <laughs> Only when I'm talking to the type of guy who can make a real difference in this world. Ted, Ricky's been working overseas for the last decade on nonprofits, so at least he walks the walk. Well, that's nice. But he's obviously getting his financial information from the Huffington Post. No, actually, I've been reading the San Francisco Chronicle lately. I've been following your potential merger with World River. It's interesting, unexpected. Okay, hey, yeah, uh, there's a ton of people inside that still want to meet you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'd like to hear this. Unexpected how? Oh, come on. I mean, they're the Yang, and you got that big old Yang. It's a perfect fit. In what way? Well, you're old school. They're new age. You got common sense, but they got radical new ideas. For my money, I'm going common sense over radical new ideas all day. I'm sure the people in Portland and San Francisco agree, and that's what makes you guys great. But they're pretty good too. Together, you guys would be unstoppable. Mm -hmm.